Hey everybody, welcome back to Chamberlain Family Farm. So today's plant day. It's the uh, middle of February. This is normally whenever we do it. I know I said before we was gonna do it way beforehand, but with the house and everything going on, we just ain't had time. So we're planting now. So stay tuned. Okay, so what I'm doing right now is I'm using some of this cheap old weed fabric and cutting it not perfect by no means but I'm cutting it so that it helps to fill in this gap I know eventually that uh, with dirt down in there it will fill it in and do that but I kind of want it to not seep out even in the beginning so I take that and stick them down into the bottom water will come out but the dirt won't so it's just a extra step that I'm doing to kind of uh protect what we invested in and you can reuse that right these here well yeah um actually this had been out on a garden once before so um and we did not like the way it, it worked so rather than just throwing it away um i'm reusing it and if um say i was to take a plant and take it out i could actually take this back off and put it into another pot if i need to because it's going to last for a good long while. So as you can see, mom does have some stuff growing. All the cold weather stuff. But as far as the flowers and steak, tomatoes and all that stuff. None of that stuff's coming up. Peppers. Just the cold weather, which is to be expected. Now she does have other stuff planted out in the other greenhouse. So we'll check it out after a bit. First, we got to get some of this work done. Move, Ginger. And yeah, we are tight walls for the most part. Cheap, or however you want to say it. Well, there's too many people who don't have any money or got too much debt and stuff like that. And I'd rather be debt free and actually have a little bit of money in my pocket. Well, I'd say that since we started, um, you know, back in 2020, or was it 2022? I can't remember. <laughs> anyway, back when we first started, I'd say we've uh, probably saved several thousand dollars by reusing things that we already had around here. Yeah. Um, not having to run back and forth, you know, even gas, saving the, the gas or the fuel for doing things. So... It does add up over time because if we had to pay for everything straight out, uh, name brand at the very beginning, we wouldn't be as far along as we are now. Oh, heck no. Yeah. So that's a good thing. Right now we're using some uh, potting mix, which I don't necessarily like the best, but because you know, we had some difficulties and all that. We didn't get our um, our own soil going and mixed up with the compost like I wanted to do this year. So that's a goal for my next planting year is to have our own potting mix made, and uh, because it, it does it does work probably even better than what we're doing there. I think so. Yeah. And it's what got I'm, all the microbes in it. Yeah. I'm, what I'm going to do with all these eventually is, is I'm going to add uh, worm castings to it so that as I'm watering these, um, it's at least going to get the nutrients from the worm castings and uh, hopefully have a better chance of growing good, healthy plants. Still got a little dirt in the bottom of it. Yep. Oh. All gone? Not yet. Not it, yet. It's still dirt in there. Careful. Sorry. You go all the way to the Jane, bottom, Daddy. Oh, I don't know. Okay. okay. She just wants to help too. 
Whoa, no, we don't have straight arms like uh, I am. Okay, well, that's true. She ain't got no thumbs, does she? No. Just... So a lot of the seeds we ordered, it's about half and half. We got about half of them. We got all the flowers and like some of the garden variety stuff just for our family, not really to sell. We got them off Amazon. And we just got little things like this comes in a variety pack but most of the stuff we ordered to sell we got from uh, johnny seeds again we're not really affiliated with them except we buy their stuff personally they don't pay us or for advertisement they are on the little bit expensive side but their stuff is really really good they like last year we got some uh cert, some seeds from burpees if you guys remember the blue light green beans they're supposed to be stringless there was only a few of them that was stringless. Most of them, they was chewy and everything. And so that's why we went with them this year. Looks like mom's got some romas planted. Them are tomatoes. Main thing is to get enough planted for out in the garden. For our garden this year. And then whatever we got left over, we'll start planting to sell on the market stand. In the next couple months. Hey Reagan, what? show me your hands. Yeah. Fill up what Sussy got on her hands. Dirt. Dirt, right. <laughs> Are you having fun, sis? Yeah. Look. Big helper. Big, big helper. I think I am tired today. Oh, really? Booby, 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 booby. I got all the words. Do you, do you, do you. Oh yeah, mom, she went ahead and told me to put them lights up in here. Don't really need them much longer because uh, days are getting a little longer every single day. So, But if we keep things going in the fall, we can put, move some stuff out here and keep things going a lot longer. So, Ain't that right, Seth? Yeah. Now in my main greenhouse, I already have some stuff growing. So you can see my cauliflower, not cauliflower, broccoli. <laughs> Sorry about that. It's growing. And uh, so I got a good start on that. I've got some lettuce that's already growing. And I've had have another spot with some growing and I've already kind of harvested part of that. And uh, I got a few things that are kind of getting started over here. So using it all. Oh, and over here, this is actually kind of a leftover from last season. It was just a tiny little thing. I put it in here. So it's cabbage. So don't know if it's going to ever do anything or not, but it's still alive. Um, and there's a little bit more lettuce and some lettuce growing here. I'm just so ready to have spring going on. And I know that a lot of you are too. So uh, hopefully you're able to get something planted soon and um, enjoying this weather. We've got sun today, bright skies. Oh, those cloudy days make it really difficult. <laughs> so have a good one. Thank you for watching Chamberlain Family Farms. You can contact us at chamberlainff at gmail.com. You can also see us on Facebook, Chamberlain Family Farms. We hope you enjoy. Please like and subscribe.